Hey guys, good morning. Very, very early morning, 3 a.m. in the morning, and this is out of schedule. This was not a pre planned sort of a review, which is why I like this because suddenly, you know, this kind of things like happen. I used to do this back in the time. A lot of my reviews used to be very, very detailed, and uh, I used to just suddenly, you know, do things out of nowhere. <laughs> I still do it, but not as much like the way before. So, this today, I have got a fragrance for you. As you can see, I'm wearing the orange shirt and I, there's a reason for it the fragrance I'm gonna do a review full review on this um, is gonna be an orange fragrance all right so this as you guys know this is not a new purchase for me this is from my older collection this is Clinics happy for men all right so the reason I decided to do this there are a few reasons all right I have done a video where I have done like a three orange fragrances something like that it included uh, I think the ultra zest this one and one other fragrance i'm not quite sure what that was so anyway never mind so uh damn i hate when i cannot remember things so today i decided i'm gonna relax chillax and i'm gonna do this review and then yeah i'm wearing this right now for some time and just really feel like you know relaxed last few weeks uh, since i started small decanting business in bangladesh a lot of running my sister came a lot of busyness you know as you can see i cannot get back to your comments like i say i would do but i cannot do it on time but whenever i can i try right so honestly speaking i really really my intentions are not to avoid your comments all right so let's see so the fragrance today i decided to review it it's clinics happy for men there's also for women and there are a few flankers of it which we are not gonna talk about we're going to talk about this fragrance and the reason to do re-review, more like it's re-review, all right? Because it's summertime, guys. You know, Bangladesh is scorching heat and you don't need to wear something very complicated. Yes, there are fragrances for summer, but many people find fragrances like Chanel Allure Sport a bit more heavy, complicated. Or they feel like, um, you know, Azura Chrome Legend. Sometimes people tell me like it's too much for them because of the lavender and whatnot. So this fragrance right here, it's, it's not known to be a very good beast mode performer. But I think it serves its purpose and for the heat that's on right now for our Asian countries, you know, surrounding neighbors, they, they can feel the heat too. It's, it's terribly hot. It's just, it's a shame, you know, seriously. So Clinic Happy comes into, I think, different sizes. I have the 50 ml here with me, which is like a running down, I think, yeah, a fair bit down. I used a lot of it and this is really a beautiful, gorgeous scent. So just for the scent itself, I'm going to talk about this. So for summer, this is a very, very easy wear. So that's the first reason. Second reason is this one deserves a full review from me. So longevity is not, shouldn't be the only criteria that where a fragrance passes or fails, you know, it's just not fair. So let me show you the box. You have seen this before. Let me show you again for those who haven't seen. So as you can see, the box is even more orange, <laughs> more orange than my t-shirt. So there's like a smaller box. If you buy the bigger bottle, it's going to get like bigger. All right. So it's a 50 ml, you know, you can see all the information. I'm not going to read it out. There's a batch code down there. And I think this is made in Switzerland right here so clinic actually known nothing much actually um, to the box the clinic basically known for the very very high quality skincare products you know like facial washes like balms for ladies they have also few fragrances so for men only fragrance that I came across and I like is this so maybe I'll give it a try some more ladies fragrance I don't know so the bottle looks like this I've shown you before uh, hate this fingerprint magnets all right now it looks better huh? So Clinics Happy for Men, right? Very nice uh, orange sort of bottle color. I'm not quite sure if the juice is orange. I haven't de decanted it. And the top is like inside orange. Very nice presentation, you know? It's a chromish feel, but it's a plastic. Nothing much, not much weight to it, but looks nice. Compliments. So if you had a bigger bottle, the ratio to the cap and this, the bottle pretty much the same, 50-50. Bigger bottle, the bottle gets bigger, all right? So yeah, below is your sticker and whatnot. I think you can find all your information. So the price for this is still retail. I think it's it's not very expensive, but not very cheap, right? I got this from Malaysia, so go. I think it costed me around what, uh, fifty or cost me around forty, fifty dollars like that. So yes, it is expensive, fairly, right? But then yeah, one thing that I got this on a coupon. There's some sort of coupons I used to have from Sogo, so I got it much cheaper. I got fifty bucks off, right? So yeah. So let me read out the notes for this from Fragrantic, and I'll tell you. What are the good things about it and why i like it and if there are any bad sides apart from the performance all right so according to fragrantica here i got my notes it says um clinic by clinic happy by clinic is a citrus aromatic 
fragrance for men. Clinic Happy was launched in 1999. Uh, the notes are lime, green notes, mandarin orange, lemon, and sea notes. Middle notes are freesia, jasmine, lily of the valley, and rose. Base notes are cypress, musk, gayakut, and cedar. All right, so that's a shitload of <laughs> notes they put in there. It would be so lovely if I got all of them and they really came up and they made a very strong scent, which is not the case, but they did one thing right. They got the smell spot on. I'm wearing two sprays, two sides of my neck, and it's a hot summer day and sometimes a little bit cooler night, right? So the thing is, I used to think this one doesn't last more than one hour or so, right? That's what I used to get it from Malaysia. And then see, after a fair bit of wearing here, I am starting to get a little bit performance. It lasts to me on me like two to three hours. I don't know, it's just me or it's just like, like my luck or it's the conditions. Not even on the shirt. If you wear it here, I can always like move, you know, it moves with me. If I do this, I can easily smell it. I, I got it like for no two hours now, the dry down, right? So I still pretty much get this from this area, right? So people say you have to go very heavy. So I agree, right? You have to go um, heavy sprays with this, but I think wearing too much of it is not going to hurt anybody because it's a very non-offensive sort of fragrance, right? So you can go, I, I would suggest like go two double sprays on the neck, one on the back of, back of your neck. Go cover this area very nicely, like you're wearing a collar or something. So, and then put some on your shoulders, some on your chest, on your clothes. So go like eight to 10 sprays, all right? Which sounds crazy, but yeah, it wouldn't hurt. When to wear this? Summer days, definitely hotter weather. Cooler weather, you're not gonna smell shit if you wear this, all right? It's gonna be just zero, zero. Projection of this is very, very nice for the first opening hour. Then it's very close. People come close to you, give you a hug, like, mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm, you have nice friends, some nice ladies. They're gonna be like, wow, the you use them, smells really, really good. So a while ago I was having here, as you can see, a little bit juice left. That is the orange squash, it's called, I think, um, I don't know what it's called. So it's like very refreshing. I like the taste of the orange squash. This fragrance, I said it before, very, very juicy. It, it makes me want to drink this. That is one thing I really love about this fragrance. It's very non-offensive, non-complex. And I have like few, I think seven fragrances lined up here. I'll show you one by one and I'll tell you what they're special for. Relaxation, indoor usage. If you're just relaxing by the weekend, remembering the good 90s, you know? If you remember the movie Scarface, you know, they, they go to the scene, particular scene of the chainsaw scene. So they go by the beach, you know, there's a house, there are people. So back in the days, not that many cars, not so much complexity. You know, not so many, you know, traffic, everything's relaxed. People are just walking, no terrorism and no shit, no bombing. People are just happy, you know, just relaxing. Of course, not the guy who got killed by a chainsaw. <laughs> right? It's not, it's not funny. But it's a movie, so I can laugh. So anyway, so good old times like that, you know. You watch Miami Vice, Raven, MacGyver. You watch uh, the A-Team, the Fall Guy. You used to watch, uh, what else, um, good old times, you know. The back in the time, X-Files, you know, you'd be like, wow, aliens, you know. So there was like not much thing. There's no mobile phone. This reminds me of those days, back in the school days. One of my bros used to own this in university life. He was my junior. He used to put it on. He's like, used to the brother, I really wish it lasted, which is not the case. We all know that this suffers from projection longevity, right? So in the heat, deep heat, it dies down, right? But, but this smell, good things about this. Ladies love the smell. Ladies can wear this alike. I think it's, it's going to make very, very unisex sort of a fragrance. And it will be very good for, you know, sort of office affair. If you're sitting you, where you don't need very heavy projection or heavy silage, this is good for that sort of situation. If you're living in a bit, like let's say your summers are like British summers, like not skies are absolutely clear because I've been in Britain, so I can talk about Britain. Sky is absolutely blue and you're wearing something like this, you know, it's going to remind you of that life is just simple guys you know easy shopping if you're going for cinema or something you just carry a decan refresh in the middle of the day it's that good ladies love this stuff my lady she, she's like wow this stuff is sparkling that's what she said about this right so i decided like you know for what let me do it again right see the sprayer is also very nice so yes i got some side of my face of which i don't mind i wish i could taste it but i wouldn't risk it all right what else? The projection, as I told you, one hour, maybe one hour and a half. It, it, it will be like close to your skin. The summer days, you know, however, I have few fragrances, as I told you. I'm going to show you one by one. I have few, I always try to collect few fragrances from different genre, different 
you know, like, like let's say I have green tea, like tea. So I got Gucci Purim too, but I think it has a little complexity, like Fahrenheit, it has violets and whatnot, spicy kick. So for tea, I got this. This, all this fragrance I'm going to show you gives me the feels of simplicity. This gives me feel, feel of relaxation, holidays, you know, where you can sit in a zen place. Clinics happy, similar to this. Lemon-based fragrance, the most, this is also not a performer, but it's from Dior. And this is really, really best, simplest lemon-based scents. Usavage, the original Usavage. Neroli, you guys know what my favorite fragrance is. Versace Spuram. Another blue scent based on cucumber and then some like citrus and whatnot for summer days. Very non-complicated, very, very easy wear back in the time. I just treasured this. This and Clinic Sappy, almost identical. Just a few notes are different. For pineapple based scents, I have Aventus, I have Club de Nuit, but this is, I think, is much more smoother. If you love pineapple, Lavender, very smooth pineapple note in this with lime. Then if you love green fragrances, you might think this is a powerhouse, but no. This is a very classy, elegant and smooth green scent. Pakuraban Puram on the dry down, beautiful. It gives the feel of woods, fresh woods. And I took this in Cameron Highlands during the long drive. Whew, this thing stays with you in cooler weather very nicely. And then my latest love is Aspen, which I crave for a very long time. So all these fragrances give me the feel of relaxation. This is where Clinic Happy comes. I think that I'm going to rock this. I forgot about this fragrance. I forgot to add this in my summer list. So yes, guys, some people are crazy about longevity and whatnot. For you guys, I don't recommend this, all right? Forget it, all right? No need to go and buy this. But for the people who are from 90s kids, who have good memories of it, like Polo Sport, you like Safari, you know, like CK1, CK Contradiction, CK Craze. So a lot of those fragrances that you remember, the simple days, this is one of them. This is the, one of the easiest wear. It, it's not going to offend anybody. Never going to be getting hatred, whatever. One thing you can get, like, people might think you're childish or underaged. Yeah, I, I, I said underaged. Because this one doesn't have the seriousness of heaviness, you know. Patchouli, darkness, you know. Tar, you know. What else? Um, I don't know. Something serious note. It doesn't have that. Leather. None of it. So opening this, a lot of notes. This, coming back to the notes, I don't get that many notes like people say a lot of citrus you know yeah, there's a <laughs> sense of citrus which wears off with the, but the with the orange it opens like mandarin orange the orange remains all right but the citruses in the opening doesn't last if this they made edb version of this or maybe a stronger version of this gave a little bit more potency this would be a 10 out of 10 for a summer fragrance all right at this point despite all the longevity and every other issue, I'm going to still give this <laughs> how much? I, I want to give 8.5. I'm going to give this 9 out of 10, guys. The smell of this, if you look for smell, just solely about smell, nothing, not that many fragrances can do from a designer house. You know, these days people talk designer niche. What I really see is money versus not so expensive. That's what these days niche and designer differentiation is, right? Many of the niche fragrances don't last, right? And they don't particularly smell that great. So for summer, excellent. Age, any age can wear this. Any age. If you're a happy person, if you if you're if you're not a douchebag, if you're not a racist, if you're not um how to say, if you have a big heart, you wear this. I don't think, you know, it, it sends good vibes. You're a friendly person, nice person. It has all that vibes, you know. Um occasion, I don't think of like maybe if you're school or university and college, the weekends, you know, no work. You're just like putting someone, relaxing, you know. If you like mojito or something like, you know, those sort of accords, you're going to love a little bit uh, sparkling grapefruit or orange. This vibe from this, all right. Yeah, I love this clinic happy. I'm going to be wearing this in the summer. So I want to do a full review. My ultimate mark, I still give this 9 out of 10. If this had performance, that one category, I'll give this 10 out of 10, all right. So yeah, there you go, clinic happy was not pre-planned but i really wanted to do it i saw it i'm like wearing it ah let me wear some more <laughs> yeah this one you can offend anyone mm, really zesty very very fresh mm, uplifting so guys look into clinics happy just go to the mall and sniff this stuff all right i'm just telling you if you're looking for a non-complicated scent clinics happy is a good one take care